Project Runway finale, just finished watching it. We have our winner for the season and I'm just gonna jump right into it because I was so happy to see Jeffrey win. Like we're not saving that till the end of the end of the episode. We're going into that right now. He just seems like such a genuinely good person that I I was rooting for him. You know, what he was doing with his collection could have very easily been total miss. Like he he had some wild ideas out there especially with the heavy on the metal like i see those metal jackets go out there and i i, I want to put one on it's very rare on project runway that i want to put on one of the garments but like i wanted to t i want to know what those feel like i want to know what it feels to wear i d i want to get in those clothes i i also was a huge fan of the designers getting to select their models from a much wider variety of models like we it's good to see nancy had some some very unique models uh jeffrey having having the male models i think one of my favorites all time uh, on project runaway his name was brandon who originated from male streetwear and i would have absolutely loved to see his final collection with some male models like Jeffrey did today today I I just think that's a great addition for the show a great direction for the show to take it's it's awesome seeing the the model walk down the runway with a blinged out prosthetic leg it's awesome seeing some different ideas than what we're accustomed to as the perfect model with the with the zero waist and the, and tall and lean it's nice seeing some different body shapes walk down the the runway because people are different shapes and some of these clothes like when you see someone like yourself wearing a garment it makes it more likely for you to think oh maybe maybe i could wear something like that okay let's get back to the show so jeffrey won loved his collection the the main feature was those big puffy metal coats they were they were they were unreal all of them looked way better today I, and i think a lot of that was his styling and just the off chance that he didn't bring those little spikes that he that he had previously and the the models with with not zero makeup but very little makeup looked way better it felt like he super edited his collection. All the looks looked way better. The the one the dresses that those metal dresses that were a little shapeless before were had more had more shape, looked better on the models. I think he made better choices for what models wore what outfits. And so happy to see him win. He's he was he's the guy I was rooting for. Another person I thought did amazing on their final collection was Nancy. Nancy was all over the map. Uh, she had, she had the the wheelchair model. She had those that those dresses and that material that just looked like liquid. She had the prosthetic leg and and like so different. And and then and then like two seconds later, she has that beautiful suit walk down the runway. And it's like, Nancy, I didn't even know you could make that. I thought that was her highlight of her preview was that was the patterned pantsuit. And I uh, probably would say it was probably my favorite look of hers again. I do have to say I was a little sad when I saw the first of those those liquid dresses walk down the runway for Nancy. And it had the one with the big puffy neck neck hood thing that she didn't take that off like the judges asked i feel like those are those that like that is one of those little things that could have made the difference between her winning or not uh next up let's go to victoria she is a great tailor she makes exquisite clothing i really felt her collection wasn't at the level that that i i want to see in the finale of Project Runway. 
hers felt like she was advertising for us for a store like hey buy my buy my brand buy my clothes put it on your shelf today very wearable what she had walked down the runway uh, almost all of it was perfectly tailored looked great but just felt bland especially compared to nancy and jeffrey's collections her showstopper piece happens to be this dress she threw together in two hours blows the rest of her collection out of the water really brought me back to more of what victoria did throughout the season and why i was really rooting for her up to, up to the final here so if she i think if she would have brought out a collection more along the, the lines of that dress that she would have had a very good chance of taking home the victory our last designer was sergio and i just felt like his collection just wasn't wasn't even remotely close to being good enough we've seen throughout the season him have like impeccable technique be a very good designer very strong designer but it's like he is obsessed with telling this story sending out this message above the clothes and i feel like that de detracted from his potential and what he could have done we saw the judges say his best piece was the t-shirt that he threw together at the end because of a critique he got at the last minute and thought sure i'll go for it and if he had taken uh, brandon's critique from the week before when he said you know just m mess it up you go crazy Sh go off the wall show us something we've never seen before and he and Sergio did none of that. He brought none of that to his collection. It looked dated. It looked old fashioned. And really, I, I thought he was just the bottom of the final four here. Uh, overall, I really enjoyed this season. I like, I like seeing the, the show kind of move in a, in a new direction. I really enjoyed how the designers had more of a say in their models this year i like that we saw a wider variety of models uh we have seen that in seasons past where you know some some different models come in but this season really took that to a whole nother level and i thought it really elevated the show overall made it more interesting for me as a viewer and i and i thought we got to see a lot more creativity out of all the designers so that's it really enjoyed this season so happy jeffrey won so happy to see nancy in the finale and that's it i don't know when the next season is but i will be back and as always thank you so much for watching and we will see you later